Hello, it's Michael Watts here, and in this video I'm going to be looking at something that I call the Grand Piano Sustain Pedal uh, approach to playing. Uh, as the name suggests, this is heavily influenced by piano players, uh, guys like Eric Satie, Bill Evans, uh, even Keith Jarrett, although you don't have to pound your foot and start hooting along uh, in the background unless you really want to. Um, the reason I'm showing you this now is that I'm part way through writing a new piece. It's called Lords of the Hundreds and um, you may have actually seen it in its larval form uh, in a couple of demo videos that I've shot recently on this channel. <laughs> I'm really enjoying it as a piece, I'm enjoying playing it, and I'm also enjoying uh, exploring the different uh, places that it's taking me. And one of these is a very open, dark, and um, textural, uh, atmospheric kind of mood, uh, which is a stark contrast with the, the more intricate uh, intro. Now, this demands different things from the player, obviously, and um, to be honest, the past couple of weeks or so that I've been working on this, I've found it hard work. It has demanded quite a lot from me. Uh, as such, I thought it might be a, a useful uh, exercise to share with you. Uh, just before we start, I do need to point out that uh, because we're relying on uh, sustained uh, texture between chord movement, um, the way that you hold your instrument is very important as well. And when I play this part, I make sure to leave a gap between my body and the back of the guitar so the top and the back are free to vibrate fully as a, uh, as a functioning air pump. Thank you, Irvin. This exercise depends on concentration as much as accuracy and uh, as such it really depends on you being in the moment when you play and being conscious of the sound that you're making, listening critically and obje as objectively as you can. As such, I hope you enjoy it and uh, without further ado, here we go. I really hope this video has been useful for you. If you have any questions or comments, please do drop them below. And uh, until next time, stay tuned. 